Does anyone know who made the first digital synthesizer? No, who no. Tell us, Mr. Audio. Analog synthesizers actually date back to the 1920s, but the best known analog synth was developed by Dr. Robert Moog in the 1960s. In the 1970s, Hal Alice of Bell Labs developed the experimental Alice machine, known as Alice, with 72 computer-controlled oscillators. In 1981, Yamaha introduced the GS1 FM digital synthesizer, and in 1983, the much more commercially successful DX7. Both used digital frequency modulation tone generators to produce the sounds. They were called digital operators as opposed to oscillators. The Yamaha synths were based on the research of Dr. John Chowning of Stanford University and were a vast improvement over analog synths in creating sounds with complex and percussive attacks. Around 1987, Roland introduced their D50. This was a hybrid synth using analog synthesis with digital samples. Based on research that showed people identified sounds primarily by the information in the attack portion of the waveform, this synth used the actual digital samples for the attack and analog tone generation for the sustain and decay portions. About the same time, companies like Fairlight, New England Digital, and Kurzweil developed sampling synths that used multiple digital samples of real instruments. For example, every note of a piano could be sampled at several levels of touch, from slightly hitting the key to really clobbering it. As the electronic musician played, the keyboard would sense the velocity and play the appropriate sample. This enabled these synths to sound more like the actual instruments they were emulating than ever before. Thanks, Mr. Audio. For more interesting facts about sound, visit Mr. Audio at soundimages.com.